What up guys, it's C. Mickey, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be reacting to Family Guy Cutaway Compilations from Season 14, Part 6 it says. I would say pretty much uh, Season 14 is alright with me, I, I like that season. But let's just get right into the video. Brian, this can't go on! Chris is out of control! He's even more arrogant than an actor, writer, director. Well, my script is brilliant and I'm a great director. The question is, how bad do I want this part? <laughs> okay, I'll do it. In any case, Ryo, I'm very proud of you and your progress. You, my friend, are the greatest invention since the Trapper Creeper. We are binge watching this whole show. I mean, I haven't been listening to something since the Shawshank Redemption. Yes, um, after you escaped into the I'll hole, I'll make us try to laugh, so I haven't mocked yet. Attach the Raquel Welch poster from inside the hole with a tautness that a rock could pierce? Does it really matter? It does to me. Did you even like the movie? I did very much up until that point. I'm not gonna laugh, so... Ah, this is it, Bri. The Quahog Racket Club, where frail old men come to weigh themselves in the nude. Does that say 84 or 85? It says 63. Oh, dear. How'd you get all those cuts on your butt? You're right. I guess jealousy's my weak spot. Everyone has one, even Achilles. So you can only be injured on your Achilles tendon. That's right. My mother dipped me into the river Styx, and she held me by my heels. So that's the only part that can be injured. How about you, Testicles? It's the same. It's, it's, it's similar. And who shazams the Beatles? Whatever, have fun with your little robot. But if you ask me, this whole thing is more disturbing than a dump after a beet salad. Ah! Oh, right. Mm -hmm. I love blacks, I love Asians. Hell, I even love gay aborigines. That part almost got me. Now return to Star Trek Creep Space Nine. Speed. <sighs> All right, I'll go. But I'm not happy. You know how much I hate being told what to do. <laughs> we now That's turn gross. to the autistic postman always rings 400 times. to celebrate. I mean, I ain't done nothing fancy since I bought those rich guy socks. Ah, there. I'm ready to get caught cheating with my secretary. I am sorry. Look, th th this isn't us. This is just the no food and sleeping in a car talking. We can make this work, like couples who meet on Craigslist. You're, You're not, not what you look, look like, like in your, your picture. picture. Let's, Let's get, get this, this over with. with. I wonder which one of us is the murderer. your hernia, but you've got to stop lifting sewer hole covers. But the Ninja Turtles live down there. I'm friends with them. Hey, fat ass. I brought you flowers. But stay out of the sewers. We're trying to work down there. Thanks, Danny Tello. Mm -mm. Come on, that's ridiculous. How do you think you're going to do that? I don't know. Maybe I'll get a job working the night shift at a supermarket. Hey, where's the vegetable line? Yeah, right. It's 2 a.m. You're not here for vegetables. Well, I got the 12 <gasps> What's wrong? Just this guy at the... Oh, never mind. You know what she could use? A little sip of that drink I invented. Hi, it's Dewey Griffin oh. here with my latest creation. Monster energy drink. What is it? I don't know, but it's free from this truck that stopped outside your work. Mix it with booze. Mm. Ever been wide awake, blacked out? Ever try to jump over a train on a bike? Ever bit the beak off a bird? Monster energy. Put it in your body and ask questions later. It's green, so it's nature. Oh, you're really obsessed with Patty. You want her even more than I wanted the new iPhone. No. How's it going? Good, just looking forward to getting that new phone. What are you talking about? This isn't the Apple Store. This is a super gay club. Yeah, right. I leave and you get my phone. Nice try, cutie pie. <laughs> we now return to Dateline. Our story tonight. The guy you think did it, he did it. Now go to bed. Your grandkids are coming tomorrow. 
We now return to The Price is Right, nope. now with male models. Let's look at this beautiful new car, presented by Ken. I don't want it. <laughs> Just bad writing. Yeah, I mean, we could write a better horror movie than that. Really? You think we could? Yeah, absolutely. I'm as creative as the first spider to spin a whip. Hey, you know how we always dreamed about having a house that comes out of our butts? Well, uh, what? Huh? Yeah, butt house. It would get them out of the house. Well, that's true. And I gotta do something, because they're more annoying than ants at a picnic. Would you mind turning that down? And you're not supposed to be grilling. I know you can understand me. Oh my god, I can't believe I stole this. You know what? I don't feel bad. That woman's a nightmare. <gasps> Ooh, I should text this to my best friend. Sick brooch! Adam, are you done with that mayor homework yet? It's called a bill, Mom. So far, this has been a bigger waste of time than an acceptance speech at the Asperger's Awards. I'd like to thank everyone I've ever met in the order that I met them, last name first, and if anyone interrupts me, I'll have to start over. He's becoming a star! That's right! Man, this must be what it's like to be Anne Hathaway's parents. Oh, that's Anne's car. Ugh. Huh. We now return to Kevin James Got Too Fat to Be in Movies. Kevin James, why'd you have to come back to television? I ate Adam Sandler. Uh, Yoo-hoo! I'm in here with the pizza! Man, look at them. They make such a cute couple. Like Pac-Man and Ms. Pac-Man. <laughs> what? Of course not. We're friends. Uh, yeah, no, I, I know. That's, that's, that's mm -hmm. what I thought. And also, you bring me dead birds. I know Lois gets mad about it, but I like using them to point at things. Hey, did they move the bagels? Yeah, they're right there. Oh my god, what the hell is that? This? This is a pointing bird. I mean, you don't understand. Karen made me feel worse than a guy getting cut from a baseball team. You wanted to see me, coach? I'm sorry, Kyle. You can't do this boring, stupid thing with us. Look, I'm just happy you pushed me, because now I can't wait for that tournament. I know, it's going to be great. And I already know exactly where I'm going to put that trophy. So the baby died? Oh, yeah, the baby died. my god. But look, first place. <laughs> Maybe we could grab lunch and then see what happens. <sighs> This will not end well, like eating an artichoke. Good lord, I ate nothing and I'm soaking wet for some reason. We now return to the Awkward Stepdad Show. Man, your mom's a real groaner. Do you hear that in your room? <laughs> the one with, uh, the, when the girl's burying her book in, uh, on her chest and you hear that guy, like, motorboating. Motorboating her? Uh. <laughs> Another one that almost got me was the guy in the bathroom stall. That was that one was like, oh, okay. That didn't the no that didn't break me. Ah! Oh, right. Then there was that one where Peter was in that bathroom. His and that sign said all employees must wash hands. <laughs> And the one that did get me, pretty, almost pretty much got me, was the Ms. Pac-Man. But that is my reaction to, well, that is my, I would say kind of a victory on uh, Family Guy. Uh, cutaway compilations from season 14 part 6 it says. Let me know what you guys think of the video in the comments below. Like the video and don't forget to subscribe. Later guys.